This is my hanging gardens. I've just uh, just watered them in the top there in the in the feeders, and uh, it takes about two minutes for it to soak all the way down. And basically, how I measure um, how much feed to give them is just you know you can tell how uh, dry the uh, growing medium is. Uh, you don't want to soak it every day. Uh, obviously, as the warmer weather comes they're going to need a lot more than they do in the winter and there's the collection bottles at the bottom there you can see there's a bit of algae growing in them because obviously they're hanging in the light so they will pick up that um, that algae in the bottle um, I think in the paint in the bottom bottles green so they just look a little bit nicer you don't see the algae then um, this is my new one that I've just hung and this one's going to be different to all the others because I've decided to do um, a hole either side. Um, the reason for that, as you can see, these are all growing very successful. But if you look at this lettuce here, um, it is bunched out so humongously all the way down. And um, so I figured that if I uh, cut the hole in the back, I can spread half of that growth on each side of the bottle it just might make it more balanced and give it a bit more production than it is right now but um yeah so there it is there's my uh my six rows of uh hanging gardens planted over about the last five or six weeks um newest one i just added today and uh yeah there we go